Hi there, I'm Melda from runningexpert.com. In this video, I will review the new Hoka Owner, Owner Speed Goat 5. But before we take a look at this Hoka Speed Goat 5, just hit that subscribe button. The Hoka Owner Owner Speed Goat 5 is a very nice and versatile trail running shoe for the long distance, I will say. But before we take a look and deep, dig further, further into the shoe, let's take a look at the previous version, the Hoka Owner Owner Speed Goat 4. It came out in the late 2019 and has been a fan favorite ever since. And I also think this is why it had taken Hoka so long time designing a new version. People really love this one and it really works. But there has been some improvements on the new Speed Goat 5. The first thing I would like to dig into is the midsole. It is actually the same foam in the midsole, the EVA. It is a classic Hoka midsole with the high stack height and the EVA foam. But the design on and the form on the midsole has been changed and this makes the new foam and the new midsole a little more soft and a little bit more responsive. It works really well. Another thing that has been improving a little bit is the outsole. It's still the Vibram Mega Grip, but the traction locks has got a new design, so there's even more traction on the locks. It is no secret that the Hoka Speed Goat is the uh, trail shoe from Hoka with the most traction, and it works on almost every surface on the trail. Then they redesigned the upper. It, the, the mesh is now a little bit more breathable, a little bit more flexible. It is still a quite narrow shoe, so if you are into the ultra wide toe box kind of shoe, this is maybe isn't the shoe for you. But if you like, as me, a well-fitted narrow shoe that keeps your foot in place, this is a very nice option for you. The tongue has been redesigned. As you see it on the Speed Goat 4, see it on the Speed Goat 4, the, the tongue is quite plain. Now it has been redesigned. It has now the butterfly kind of tongue. This hocks your foot and keeps your foot very much in place. Another improvement is the heel. As you see on the Speed Goat 4, there's a heel tap. And that has been changed, so it's now more high and more soft heel. I can only say my Achilles loved this. It is very nice. And then a little cherry on the cake. I really, I think that the design on the Speed Goat 4 was very nice. But I really think that Hoka has hit something very unique with this. There is so many nice designs and colorways of this Speed Goat 5. I will link in the description uh, for all the shoes you can find on our, web on our website. They are so beautiful and a very nice trail design, I think. There is a reason why people call the Speed Goat the greatest of all time. And that is because this is a very nice shoe. The traction is good. The fit is very nice. It is versatile. It is soft. It's responsive. I really think that's the reason you can't go to an ultra marathon or a trail run without seeing a runner in the Speed Goat. It is just a shoe that really works from Hoka Owner.